நைன்த் ஸ்டாண்டர்ட் சோசியல் சயின்ஸ் எக்கனாமிக்ஸ் யூனிட் ஒன் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்டிங் டெவலப்மெண்ட் பர்ஸ் பர்ஸ்பெக்டிவ்ஸ் மெஷர்மெண்ட் அண்ட் சப்ஸ்டெயினபிலிட்டி இந்த லெசன் ஒரு புக் பேக் ஆன்சர்ஸ் பார்ப்போம் டெக் பேஜ் நம்பர் டூ Roman letter 1, choose the correct answer. First one, assertion. Development increases the quality of life. Reason, people will have higher income, better education, better health and nutrition, less poverty. Answer, option A, both A and R are true and R explains E. Then second one, the term human resources refers to Option D. Collective abilities of people. Third one. For comparing development between countries, there DAS is considered to be one of the most important uh, attributes. Uh, option B. Income. Fourth one. DAS is considered a true measure of national income. Option C. NNP. Fifth one. The DAS income is also called NNP. per capita income option a average sixth one which one of the following country is not a uh, not a g8 country option uh, answer option d india seventh one which one of the following country is not a member of sarc option c china then option eighth one assertion the net national product nnp is considered as a true measure of national output reason it is also known as national income answer option a both a and r are true and r explains c a then ninth one assertion human resource is necessary for the progress of any country reason investment in education and health of people can result in a higher rate of return in the future for your country answer option a both a and r are true and r explains a 10th one the human development index hdi does not take into account the following dimensions in its calculation option a gender then 11th one among the following states which state have the literacy rate 2011 higher than national average option c tamil nadu second one the sex ratio means option b the ratio between female and male in a population then 13th one intergenerational equality is ensured under the process of option b economic development 14th one find the odd one option c paper then 15th one das is the state with the highest installed solar capacity in india option a tamil nadu then 16th one das resources are those which will get exhausted after years of use option c non renewable then 17th one thermal plant emits large quantity of dash which pollutes the environment option d answer carbon dioxide roman letter 2 fill in the blanks first one economic progress of any country is known as dash answer economic development second one the headquarters of hrd ministry is in dash sastri bhavan in new delhi third one the state having the highest literacy rate in india is answer kerala fourth one human development report of the world prepared and released by das answer united nation development program fifth one ground water is an example of das resources renewable resources sixth one the book uh, an uncertain glory was written by professor amartya sen and third roman letter match the following first one development development part of daily life second one human resource education third one solar energy renewable resources fourth one 1972 wildlife production act then fourth roman letter give short answer first one what do you mean by development take page number 285 
285 the introduction paragraph it refers to the progress of a particular field or a particular person the first point second point similarly the economic progress of a country is known as economic development is very cool first question would answer second one what are the indicators of development take page number 286 the indicators of economic development the major indicators to measure the level of economic development or net national product NNP per capita income PCI purchasing power parity PPP and human development index HDI is the fourth Roman letter the second question or the answer third question why NNP is not considered as an useful measures to compare a country's development with other countries take page number 286 for measuring a country's development its income is considered to be one of the most important factors is the first point next to second point uh, the net national product NNP is considered as a true measure of national output is the second point at the question at the question la continue pannikanga and the why you did it NNP is not considered as a useful method to compare a country's development with other countries is the very cool is the very cool third question answer fourth question why human resources is considered as the foremost resources of any country take page number 287 Human resources is necessary for the progress of any country. First point. Second point. Human resources refers to the collective abilities of people which can be utilized in the production sector. Second point. Next to third point. Therefore, investment in education and health of people can result in a high rate of returns in the future. It is the fourth Roman letter. Fourth question answer. Then fifth one, expand the following. First one, PPP. Second one, HDI. Take page number 286. Expense for PPP. Purchasing power parity. Next year and human development index HDI. It is the fourth Roman letter. Fifth question answer. Then sixth one, expand the following. NNP. And PCI take page number 286. Net national product NNP per capita income PCI. This is the fourth Roman letter, sixth question answer. Seventh question What is solar power? Take page number 289. Solar power in India. Solar power is the conversion of energy from sunlight into electricity. Either directly using photovoltaic cells or indirectly using concentrated solar power is first point. Second point, solar panels absorb the sunlight as a source of energy to generate electricity. It is the fourth Roman letter, the seventh question answer. Fifth Roman letter, answer in detail. First one, discuss the policies for Sustainable development. Take page number 287. Sustainability of development. Sustainable economic development is taken to mean development without damaging the environment. First point. Next. Uh, not comprising with the needs of, of the future generation. Second point. Third point, sustainability of development is comparatively a new area of knowledge in which scientists, economists, philo philosophers and other social scientists are working together. Next point, to achieve a real sustainability, we need to balance economic, social and environmental sustainability in equal harmony. Next point, it... Uh, in general, the question of development or progress in continuous. This is the first detail of the answer. 
second one describe in detail about environmental policies in india take page number 289 environmental policies in india environmental policies in india have been evolved considerably over the past three decades first point second point these policies have covered a wide range of issues such as air water pollution waste management and biodiversity conservation third point india faces challenges in economic development which has to be achieved with limited resources minimum externalities and in the presence of an uncertain climate one of the approaches to overcome this challenge is through the path of sustainable development fourth point the supreme court of india has interpreted and introduced new changes in environmental production uh, then fifth point article 51 ag of the constitution states that it shall be the duty of every citizen of india to protect and improve the natural environmental including forest lake river and wildlife and to have compassion for living creatures and sixth point development increases the quality of life this means that people will have higher income better education better health and nutrition less poverty and more equality of opportunities idu variku second detail oda answer third one differentiate between renewable and non renewable resources take page number 288 renewable resources non renewable resources renewable resources are renewable resources or pollution free and environmentally friendly these resources take a short time for renewal and renewable resources are non replenishable resource pollute and damage the environment million of year are needed for the formation of these resources Uh, renewable resources example solar energy wind energy water wood paper non renewable resources example metals glass fossil fuel coal petroleum natural gas diesel is the third detail or answer fourth one mention any five environmental acts and their action page number 289 Uh, list of uh, environmental act in india the tabular column irukle adile six act kuduthirukanga idhila neenga edhi five eludhikalam first one national green Trib- tribunal act 2010 action environmental production and conservation of forest and other natural resources second one biological diversity act 2002 to provide for conservation of biological diversity third one environment uh, production act 1986 providing for the production and improvement of the environment fourth one forest conservation act 1980 check deforestation and encourage afforestation of non forest areas fifth one water prevention and control of pollution act 1974 provide maintenance and restoration and quality of all types of surface and ground water is very good detail for our answer roman letter 7 hearts write in detail what kind of environmental problems you face in your locality answer nature is the gift from god this nature beauty is destroyed by pollution second point chemical industries release waste products and this get mixed with the air and water thereby polluting nature due to air pollution rain is impaired so we suffer drought and there is scarcity of water next point the chemicals destroy ozone layer due to this heat is increased during summer emission norms of vehicle should be checked river thamirabarani is polluted by the wastage and garbage thrown into it the water becomes impure and causes many diseases to the people who drink the water 
all these problems can be solved by making a combined effort by the public and the government. Roman letter 8 Life skill How is the per capita income calculated? Answer Per capita income is obtained by dividing the national income by the population of a country. National income is also called average income. Per capita equal to national income by population.